guys, so today we have a new video for you guys. <laughs> just fucking eating, bro, like, looking at the camera too, bro. You want another piece? Please, do you want to explain what we're going to be doing? So we're going to be playing fuck, marry, and kill, but then in between, once you answer those questions of like, who do you want to marry, who do you want to kill, who do you want to fuck, we're gonna ask a question in between like all of us and then we're all gonna answer our honest opinion about it. So But it's gonna be any question as in like life, relationship, boys, you ready for that shit? Yeah, it's, so it's gonna be interesting, it's gonna be fun. And then before we get started, let's just introduce our beautiful friend, Jocelyn. Look at this. This is a little tiny, tiny thing. Thing. <laughs> <laughs> this is a little tiny thing right here. Anyway. So dumb. It's like, uh, <laughs> Okay. Anyway, so she oh went. shit, I messed up the highlight. Bro. <laughs> no, that's the highlight. I paid thirty four dollars for so, this. Show, show, show that shit. Show that shit. Woo! Anyway, so we know Jocelyn from middle school and high school. So yeah, we went to the same high school and we've been really good friends since then. And then right now she's currently studying at Concordia University. You know, so yeah, so that should be. <laughs> All right, let's get started. So in this bucket, we have. A whole bunch of different names of like famous people and like all types of people. And then so we're gonna pick three of them and from those three we're gonna do those categories that Lisa's playing. Jocelyn, you ladies wanna, first. This is the honor. Honors. Okay, so I pick three? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Just pick it. Okay. Alright. Okay, you can read them to me. Alright. Let's see who we got. Okay, we got Obama, <laughs> Scarlett Johansson, and Drake. What? Oh, this is easy. That's Mary Obama. Why? Why? Oh, yeah, why? Because he has money. Yo, you yeah. have Drake, Drake, Ryan, Wait! I'm sure Drake oh, has more money. Yeah. Drake's more attractive, so fuck Drake. But if you marry him, you'll be able to fuck him whenever you want. That's right. <laughs> but, okay. Fuck whatever I want, either way. Woo! <laughs> okay, whatever, whatever. So, okay, okay. this is my last one. Uh, oh, Bill, Scarlett Johansson. What the fuck? So now, we're gonna go ahead and start with the question. So. I'm gonna start with an easy one. For you, what's the best- Is it for best... everybody or just us? For all of us, if you want. Okay. If you want to answer. Uh, for you, what's the best attribute a person can have? Just Are we like, talking about general. like, when we meet someone new, like what would do we like? Want like, to what see? do you like as in like, personality first? Or you like, like, uh, looks. sense of humor? Okay, uh, I feel like Looks, I'll... smile, eyes. Like, what's the best attribute someone can have? Being funny. Being funny. So you don't, so you're not like, awkward. Or like, if we're meeting for the first time, <laughs> I don't want to be like, there you go, and then you know the key to success to Jocelyn is hard right there. Now for me, I think I kind of agree with that. I like I'll just go with personality. Um, that really goes along with like you know who you who you are and stuff. So yeah, personality for me is a big one. Basic. Well, good. Well, okay, I'm, for me, hey, well, I'm complicated <laughs> as shit. I'm complicated as shit. So it's a whole bunch of things. It's, you gotta be, have a sense of humor. I love to laugh and stuff. Sense of humor is the best. I word. didn't know we could pick more than one. For but real, I said that fucking one. No, you didn't say one. I said, you said one. what's your best? What'd you say? Read it. I you. said for you, what's the best attribute? No yeah. attributes. The best. The best ones. I'm sorry. I'm picking the best. The ones. best ones. Shut up. Okay, answer. Whatever. Whatever. Fuck. All right, then. Fine. Just set it. I don't know. You're fucking burgers, dude. God damn. You just got the bike. Yeah. Anyways. Oh shit. No oh, fuck this shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now we're gonna go ahead and uh, it's gonna be my turn. Um. <laughs> No, me this. Okay, listo? Oh, bro, I just stole your one, bro. That's fucking dude. I just stole your one. Okay, J-Lo, Beyonce, and J. Cole. <laughs> dude, I got some good ass one, bro. Bro, I would marry J. Cole, bro. <laughs> yeah, I kill I kill J. Cole. I'm gonna marry uh Jennifer Lopez. Fuck like, Beyonce. Uh, Beyonce. <laughs> oh man, oh any time. Question. Who's more loyal? A guy or a girl? That's easy. Fucking hard. Easy. No, bro. <laughs> Honestly, I think a guy's more loyal. Let's be honest. Let's be honest. I'm gonna roll my eyes too. Much. No, let's be honest. Okay, maybe okay, maybe you're loyal. I'm not saying you're not loyal. I'm saying like in general the girls are the ones that fuck it up the most. Let's be honest. Let's be honest. Damn. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna just okay. throw it out there. I'm gonna throw it out there. Okay. I'm, I'm serious. Now. I feel like guys are more loyal. Okay, but you have to tell me. I feel like guys are more loyal because when like shit is going serious, they're the ones that stick through it and girls fuck no, it up. No, they Girls leave. fuck it up! They put their phone on airplane mode and don't listen to you. Damn, are you talking personal experience or what? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Alright, no, for me, for me I think it's like equally kind of the same. Like guys, we're like loyal but we sometimes fuck around and so so do, so do the girls. Like girls, I agree with that. girls like go and like 
if they have a guy, they go ahead and stick with the guy. But then if they want to have something else with some another person, then they can go ahead and do that. And well, the, the thing guys is, and the thing is, do the same thing. yeah. But the thing is, with girls, it's like they they can hide it more, and guys we can't. Like yeah. guys are pretty much girls are like, sneaky as stuff. shit. Yeah. girls can hide it better. Yeah, girls, yeah. The, girls can like hide that. Okay, shit I I agree with him. Yeah. Okay, maybe it's both at the same time, but girls. You don't agree with that? What What are you point of view of that? What are your point of view of that? Drink your fucking water. I think, I mean, that's my personal no, opinion. I, I agree think. with you. I, I think, yeah. I think girls just know how to hide it better. I think it's equally the same. Like, none of them are loyal. Yeah. But anyways, if you guys have any other opi like personal opinions, you can just leave that on the comments below. So just let us know what you guys think. Uh, yeah, next question. Uh, it's Jose. One, two, three. Okay. Okay, ready? Michael Jackson, David Beckham, what the <laughs> and Trump. Yo, you got Trump, bro. <laughs> Oh my god, okay, kill that motherfucking Trump. I wouldn't marry Michael Jackson. Why, Why would I marry a nigga who like abused little kids or supposedly abused little kids? Yeah, you see what I'm saying? Okay. So I guess I would have to. I'm not gonna say it. And then David Beckham, I guess, is the winner. You gotta like it. The question still is, still way up, bro. You got the turn. what's a must in a relationship? Like, what's the key fact in a relationship? Trust! Don't trust. play games. No, trust. Simple as that. How are you gonna date someone who you don't trust? If you always give, if they're gonna be like, I'm going out with my friends, and you can't be like, okay, have fun, then you shouldn't be with that person. Bye. Simple as that. You can't trust them to go out and have fun without you. Why are you dating them? So are you saying trust? I'm saying communication. No, trust, bro. Because if there's no trust, how are you even supposed to communicate? Up next, fuck, marry, kill. It's also his turn. La India Maria. Nicki Minaj <laughs> and Vanessa Hudgens. Fuck Vanessa Hudgens. Kill Nicki Minaj. Marry Lady Maria because she can cook me food. She <laughs> can't even cook, bro. <laughs> she probably. Can She's cook. a liar. Vanessa Hudgens. Vanessa Hudgens. Next, next. I'm not talking about next. All right, Lisa, it's your turn. You think I'm looking, huh? Yeah. You are looking, bro. Okay, you cheated. Okay, I dropped it. Okay, ready? Kylie Jenner, Chabelo. Okay. Vicente Fernandez. Oh! Bro, para que llegue el corazón. Para que, para que me encanta lo ayuda. I'm gonna marry fucking Vicente Fernandez. You like the old, the older people? Pero imagínate que te esté cantando de. Estos celos me hacen daño. Me lo que sé. Esos cantos te vuelven. Estos son los que si te lleguen al corazón. No sé Chabelo, I'm gonna kill the whole hey, you know, You know how you know how I'm gonna fuck, you know what I'm saying? There's only three left. There's only three left. You ready? I'll take those. I'll take the remaining three. Kim Kardashian. Okay. Cantiflas. Okay. Give me the money. My Dude. baby daddy, Sergio Ramos. Dude, I, I have to fuck Kim Kardashian. Like, I have to. No, I'm going to kill Kim Kardashian. What the hell? And I'm going to marry Sergio Ramos. So, final question. Entra le duro la dieta. Okay, so I'm going to be okay. No te casa. So, our final question would be. How did you, how'd you handle your first breakup? When was your first breakup? Let's let's start with that. When was it? First grade. No, no, no. 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 No, yeah, I was fucking sad. La vamos a llevar a un a este no te I'm good vamos now. Llamar, I'm fine. Vamos a llevar a llamar por ayuda. Restate the question for me, bro. How did you deal with your first break? How did I deal with it? How long ago was it? Probably like five months ago. No, basically, I just pretty much just like stayed low for a while. I'm not low. I wasn't out there. I did me. Took care of myself. I told you I didn't want to talk. No. <laughs> Alright, thanks guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys laughed a little, cracked a smile, that's what it's for. If you cried, that's okay. If you cried, too. if you understood what we were saying, even better. If you took some advice from us, even better. This is pretty much it. Anything gonna, you want to say? Right. What's your motto? What's your motto? Tell me your motto. The motto is wear less and go out more. Boy! So yeah, so pretty much thank you, Jonathan, for coming out. Yeah, stay tuned. We're gonna keep going with more videos. Uh, yeah. We're trying to like, you know, upload a little more often. So yeah, pretty much stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, share, and comment down below. And Woo. thank you guys for watching. So we'll see you guys in another episode of Rick Lewis Films. 
And Jocelyn. Hey. And Jocelyn. Bye. Peace out. Peace out. And I had to like, like empty out my pockets, take my jacket off, then pat me down. I'm gonna go down.